Welcome back everybody and hello to every single new visitor, it's your favorite German Potato. In today's video we are talking about the brand new Plymouth Atomic Kitten Bubble Top. You can also call it the Atomic Punk Bubble Top. This A-Class Bubble Top features 404 kilowatts, so 550 horsepower, which means it's much more powerful than a bone shaker, and 1194 kilogram. 10 acceleration, 10 launch, 6.5 handling that's less than a bone shaker and 6.7 speed. Later in the video I'm also going to show you some other stats of the car like the top speed. But now let me tell you it's uploaded by Nalak28, download in the game and you can also find it in our setup spreadsheet. And now I want to race it. In the beginning of this race you also see another new feature of the latest update guys. Um, the cars are ghosted in the beginning of every single adventure, also these private adventures which we're doing always in those recording sessions. So yes guys, this is a private session, if you want to be part of those races, join us on Discord. So guys, this is a track which is going to be finished on dirt. <laughs> this makes it even more interesting as the last 10% of the race are dirt. So yes guys, this is the Durvant uh, Lakeside Dirt Race, something like this, and I'm already first. After starting from 6th or 7th, you've seen the mental acceleration of this bubble top already. Welcome again everyone, I'm fighting with Mr. Barcode right now, a regular from our stream, but you also see the problem of this car, which is the handling. Only 6.5. It's a handful to drive. Okay, it's very, very slightly, uh, very slidey, but you just have to get used to it and then it's actually okay. Um, the beginning right now wasn't also my best racing, or let's say after Barcode was, uh, was overtaking me. He's racing the Lotus 11, which is also one of the best A-Class cars. So this lobby is filled with amazing A-Class cars. We also got the Alfa Romeo Stradale, for example. Here we go. Okay, Mr. Barcode. How's it going? Can you handle the Johnson pre uh, pressure? That's my question for you now. Okay, I'm coming in my slightly, uh, slidey atomic kitten. Oh yes, I'm coming closer, HJ, aka Barcode. I'm coming closer. So let's see, let's see. Oh, very, very tricky corner. Using the handbrake here. And now let's accelerate better than him in his Lotus 11. Which is also so good. Yes, guys, I'm back. I know it took me a while for this video. But yeah, definitely tell me, how do you like this Barrett Jackson car pack? And which other cars you want to see from it? Well, I'm still fighting and now we are reaching the dirt part. <laughs> 18%. So let's see if this uh, bubble top is actually surviving this. Ah, uh, barcode on my outside. He's got sli oh, he's got slightly better handling, but there I was touching him. Not on purpose, though. Okay, so I've got the better line now. I'd say he's wall riding there. I am coming back, and yes, <laughs> nice finish there with my teammate here, Mr. Barcode. But I think Team Red is losing. What's going on, Team Red? Come on! Welcome to the Lakehurst Forest Sprint, our number one track. And let me also tell you, we have Mr. SCT Abiotic Soup in here, which is Ahmed Galal, also another Forza Motorsport and Horizon YouTuber, who's doing some dirt uh, drag stuff and so on, who's comparing cars. So yeah, give him a follow. I'm definitely going to link his channel in the description, guys. And never forget, don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe if you like our content. While I'm fighting Mashiro <laughs> in his great old car and gaps in the Subaru 20B. Another very, very great A-Class car. So yeah, guys, this bubble top. Um, I find it very amazing that these weird cars are the best ones in A-Class in Forza Horizon 4. Why, though? <laughs> we have a racing game, we have a car game. Oh, yeah. We got the Bone Shaker, we got this, and there's another car from Barry Jackson Car Pack, which is amazing. Um, which I definitely want to cover in one of the next videos. You can guess which one it is. I won't tell you right now, but yeah. It's also a very, very interesting fella. While I'm in the lead right now and Team Red is also leading. Nice. Finally. Finally. So let's see what the lap time at the end of this track says. As I can definitely compare, I can definitely compare to my other laps here. And after this race, I'm also going to show you Stats round number two, 
you're going to see the top speed and so on. Okay, here we go guys, we're already at 270 kilometers per hour. I can tell you that the bone shaker is topping out here at something like 280. So the bubble top is definitely faster than a bone shaker, which is mental. And you've also seen the acceleration. And the lap time is a 316, <laughs> which is so great after I was starting from one of the last positions. So yeah, this car is OP. Welcome to the stats part number two. As you can see, the car reaches 97 kilometers per hour in 2.1 seconds, which is a very, very good value. The top speed says 305 kmh, which is also amazing. And you also see the lateral Gs with 1.0 each. Let's head to the next race. The Adam Brass Station Circuit, and this is going to be a Johnson Challenge, guys. Means I let every single one pass and try to win this race. This is going to be very, very interesting. But yes, the car can shine firmly. By the way, guys, it's very, very ironic that I just upload this best A, um, best A class cars number two video like two weeks ago, and then this new OP car arrives. And yes, like I said before, there's even another one. So yeah, very, very interesting. So best A class cars number three confirmed. Um, things happen here. Things happen. Oh my God, bite! Oh, bite! Come on! <laughs> Where did Byte want to go there? <laughs> did you see this? He was so much on the inside, like, like jumping in there. Oh god. Okay, number three in game. I just overtook him. And now, let's see if I can get to the first positions. We got Sanu in the lead, who's a very good driver as well. So, let's see. Sticky Flames in the Evo. I tried to overtake him on the outside, and then we got the Roadblock Mashiro. Nice, nice stuff. Oh, Sticky Flames missing that checkpoint, I think. Oh, no, he's not disappearing right now. He's not disappearing, so everything looks fine. Okay. Dashi in the BMW. Here we go, come on. 6.5 handling only in my car. These long turns are not the best for the car. The best ones are those 90 degree ones where you can simply accelerate afterwards. As you can see, the others got much more downforce, or let's say, cornering speed than I have. But this doesn't really matter. After... <laughs> oh no, it was a leg! It was a leg! Nice! <laughs> that looked great. That looked so great. Okay, guys. I'm uh, fourth already. Oh god, no! Oh, oh my god. That was a total dive bomb. I'm so sorry. Nice driving. Yes. So sorry, Sanu. So, so sorry. My bad. <laughs> I was way too late there. Anyway, I'm not waiting right now as I'm going to catch barcode. Or let's say I want to catch barcode. <laughs> Boo, Johnson. Now the video, the comment section is going to be filled with some people are calling me a ramming noob again. Anyway, come on, Mr. Barcode. Let's see. Oh, he's touching the inside. He's touching the inside. Mr. Barcode couldn't handle the Johnson pressure. Okay. Here we go. We are in the lead. The Johnson challenge is going to be successful. But yes, once again, I'm very, very sorry, Sanu. That was my bad. Uh, as you guys have to know, there are no brakes installed in the car. It's the stock brakes. These are the stock brakes, so yeah. Definitely break earlier than normally when you're using our tunes. Welcome to the Colossus, the monstrous speed track in the game, guys. We are having the Johnson Challenge once again. Let's see if I can win this race, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be very, very interesting. As we probably have some speed cars in here, so let's see. 20 seconds until we are getting visible. Let's say until... Oh my god. <laughs> That's always great. He's just getting unghosted uh, when I'm right behind him. <laughs> it just felt so good when I was driving through him. Anyway, we are there. We are there. Let's see if I can win the race. Barcode in the lead, gaps on second. Guys, never forget to tell me which other cars you want to see in future videos in the comment section. Very crucial for me to plan my future content. Well, I'm just fighting these people. And as you can see, there are many red cars in here. Whoa. That was close, but yeah. You always see the amazing acceleration of this car and... Oh, this is messy. Flying Blizzard just dive-bombing the poor number three in-game there. 
Oh, number three in game. I think we definitely have to get you a cookie. As I saw that your Mudstar is definitely not the best car for today's recording session. Okay, so guys, let's sum it up. This car is OP. I can tell you it's OP. If you're on very narrow handling tracks, it will be a problem. But as soon as you have all these sprint tracks with so much acceleration parts and so on, even the normal handling tracks like Asmo for example, the car will be OP there, just like the Bone Shaker. And it's even faster. It's even faster regarding the top speed and the acceleration, but yeah, the handling is worse. So you definitely have to see which car of these is your favorite one. We are on 6, so let's see. It's the Super GT position. Oh god, I was braking very, very early there. Too early. But yeah, that's what you've also seen before. You have to brake early in this game. You have to brake early. Well, I'm just very close to bite here. The top speed of Barcode's car in his Lotus 11 seems to be very good as well. So we might not get him, as he definitely had some good starting positions today. Luke is in front of me right now on 4th. Oh my god, I'm definitely messing up this turn. I... Missed the checkpoint! So yeah guys, I'm just right behind Mr. Ahmad Galal right now. If you want to see other A-Class videos, check the info card now for some more OP cars in A-Class. Um, if you're interested in this stuff, before you click away because of my mistake. <laughs> no, you don't. Oh, Mashiro also missed the checkpoint. I'm 10th. So yes, what is the comeback mode saying? So yes guys, I'm heading into the last turn. I hope you enjoyed this new OP car. I hope you're enjoying the Barrett Jackson car pack. Tell me how you like it. This is the last trade of the video. Don't forget to smash the like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you like what you've seen. And don't forget to click the bell to get notified. And I see you next time, ladies and gentlemen. I'm really liking this car. And right now you see two other videos all the time. Click one of them if you're interested in more racing stuff.